That what? was crazy. <laughs> Let's do an action replay because the dust has settled now. But uh, I mean, the players, they're so good. They're another level. They saw all of that and it wasn't obvious at all. Uh, the queen retreating to d3 was the move we expected. The only safe square, but Magnus, of course, surprised us. Queen takes knight, giving up his queen for two pieces. Knight takes d7 now, so he's got a bishop and a knight for that queen. All sorts of threats, such as hitting this bishop. Maxime did not even hesitate, giving the queen back for the knight and a rook this time. Let's do some counting. Tanya, help me out. Mathematics, unlike Maxime, is not my strong thought, <laughs> uh, forte here. So Black's got a rook, David, and how many pawns is that? That's four, seven to five. So a rook and two, two pawns, points. that's seven points for Black. And White's got a bishop and a knight, so six pawns points for White here. Math doing the math, Black does have an edge, but if White is able to get the minor pieces active, uh, I think it's going to be White with the advantage here. You want to develop your bishop?